Well, welcome. Thank you again for joining us this beautiful Friday evening. Every Friday evening is beautiful because it's Friday evening, but thank you for joining us. Tonight our first act is Kate. Now Kate is um, an alternative pop singer-songwriter living in London, England right now, but she's originally from Abbotsford right next door. Uh, she just released the new EP, Love the Madness, available on Apple Music and Spotify. Enjoy, please, and take it away, Kate. Hi guys, my name is Kate. I'm so excited to be here doing a virtual concert for you guys, the Langley Arts Council. Um, a bit about me, I grew up in Abbotsford, BC, and I just moved to London, and I just put out an EP last week, which is very exciting. It's my first project that I've put out, it's six songs, and they're all about growing up, and just like, yeah, growing up in Abbotsford, and traveling, and doing all that, and turning 20. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited. That's out in the world now. It's called Love the Madness. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna sing some songs from it today. That's cool. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna start off with a track. It's called 4AM. It was the single um, off of the EP that was out a week ago now. Um, but yeah, it's called 4AM, and I wrote it with my good friend, Kian. Um, but yeah, so this is it. I'm gonna do like a kind of, a slower version of it. Why don't you come over for a little bit tonight? It doesn't even matter how long is your drive. Are you thinking of me the way I wish you would? Are you thinking of I could go all night long And I know, and I know, and I know he's wrong And I know, and I know you got a girl at home So why don't you come over For a little bit tonight It doesn't even Are you thinking of me the way I know you could? Why don't you come over? It's only friendship will risk. You can cry on my shoulder if it's her that you miss. Are you thinking of me in a new light? Cause if not, we can pretend for for the night I know you think that it's fun when you pull me in but I can't help but think that this is more than friends and I know and I know and I know it's wrong and I know and I know you've got a girl at home but why don't you come over Yeah, that's 4 a.m. Um, that one's 
kind of fun because I literally met Kian and he produced this entire project and I met him and within like an hour I like brought this chorus and I was like please write with me it'd be so fun and we finished it in like 15 minutes so that was really cool but yeah the whole EP was written by like me and my two best friends which is kind of awesome um and so me and Tessa my roommate slash co-writer and friend we did the whole project together and yeah, so that's kind of super fun. And I feel like it would only be right for me to do a song that I wrote about Abbotsford now. I was gonna call it Abbotsford, but I decided not to. So this one's called If I Need To, and it's kind of just cause all my friends are engaged, you know? It's fun, sh it's fun stuff. Everyone from a hometown's married still sells weed from his parents' basement But the high is not as good now that our lives are complicated And I wish I could be happy playing safe and playing nice I wish I could be happy with what I know Cause I that's if I need to um and yeah that one's very special to me I think that's my one of my favorites off the EP we just released lyric videos for every single one of the songs so I'm so excited I'm gonna drink my apple juice um I'm so excited because we put them all out and they're all really interesting and I just like love them all and like we took so much time making each little one because we can't make music videos so we're like let's just put out lyric videos and make it as fun as possible um, so I'm really proud of them, but this lyric video is literally just a whole bunch of home videos that I made my mom send over, which was awesome. Mm -mm -mm. Forgot a water bottle, so I'm just gonna be drinking apple juice. Good old London apple juice, you know? Um, okay, next song I'm gonna do is Pity Party. 
this one I wrote, actually I was supposed to meet, be meeting Tessa because we were finding apartments at the time and I was late, obviously, and I wrote this song because I miss my mom, like a lot. Um, so yeah, this is Pity Party. All right. I woke up in a new bed today. It's my own, I guess, but it doesn't feel that way. I'm so tired of the jet lag. I thought it was a hoax. This grown up shit is getting old, and I miss my. party and that's all the time I have left so thank you so much Langley Arts Council for having me I'm so excited um yeah the EP is out right now it's on Spotify Apple Music everything like every platform you can imagine uh, all the lyric videos are on YouTube and yeah it would mean a lot if you could go check them out and if you like the EP send me a message or yeah anyways thank you so much for tuning in and I will catch you on the flip side Thanks again. Okay, bye. Wow. Thanks, Kate. That was incredible. You have a, a beautiful, beautiful voice. And um, you, you tell a story with each of your songs, and, and I love you bringing that to your, your, your music. Thank you so much. My name is Lana Hart. I go by she. 
Kirk. Uh, I'm the president of the Langley Arts Council, enjoying it thoroughly. I'm in the studio, so here I get to hang art and work with the artist one on one and hang really amazing group exhibitions where we showcase all the different styles and, and mediums of work. And then outside of here, I do have my own professional practice. Um, and my studio is not too far from here, so I get to spend my time there and work on my own shows and my own body of work. What is it incorporated into my life? Well, I like to tell the story about when people say, well, what good is art as a career? Well, art isn't just painting, it's designing. You wouldn't have cars without artists. You wouldn't have clothes without artists. You wouldn't have cutlery, spoons, knives, forks, plates, inner plates, scarves, shoes, without an artist. So think about that. I'm a fiber artist and I'm working on that. So it's my form of meditation, it's my form of stress relief, and it's my form of a creative outlet. So it's, it's everywhere. So I have uh, my own art practice. So I work here part time, and then I work at home part time in my studio. So I'll paint and I draw, and then I also teach uh, from, my, from my home studio as well. So I kind of weave different things together. Well, the Langley Arts Council has a, a mission of bringing the arts awareness to not just artists, but everybody in our community. And our communities uh, involve both the city of Langley and the township of Langley. And we work really hard to make arts known, appreciated, and supported. Our mission is to uh, grow the arts, but also to support the arts in our community as a way, I think, as a means of connecting people to themselves, to each other, to something bigger, to fun ideas and really interesting thoughts. Um, so it's about, it's about fostering the arts, but also, I think, because of that, fostering people and the community through, that, through the arts. To definitely provide arts and culture to the community, um, to, I find, a platform for artists to share their work and um, for other people to explore different forms that they wouldn't necessarily think of or they might have an interest in but don't have a means to be able to explore. Okay, our second act up tonight is Laura Koch. She is um, a Langley-based musician. She's the front woman of the local band, The Corks. She's the winner of the Excellence in Performance by Female Artist at the Fraser Valley Music Awards in 2017. Let's listen to Laura. Hello, my name is Laura and I am so happy to be included in this concert series. Um, I am a local Langley-based artist, uh, have been known as the leader of The Quirks, which is a Langley-based folk pop band. And I also do my own solo work. So I'm so happy to be here. Big thanks to um, the Township of Langley and Langley Arts Council for including me in this. Um, yeah, just really happy to be involved. So um, what was described to me was that this is an event that uh, is ongoing over a little while and is just seeking to bring some light and joy to the residents of Langley. And I thought that sounds right up my alley. Um, it's a heavy time this this pandemic time and uh, I think so many of us are feeling it in in each our unique ways you know some of us are very busy because we're maybe essential service workers or we're homeschooling our children for the first time or um, oh, for a countless countless reasons that we might be uh, quite busy and others of us are, are sort of trying to figure out what to do with work I'm in that category um, just as a songwriter and as a performer um, there's not a lot of opportunity for performance right now. So it's a strange time for us all. Um, so I'm going to sing you a few songs, uh, the first of which is called Rainy Monday. And I wrote this song uh, when my mother had had a brain aneurysm and was going through months and months of, of hospital time and rehab and different kinds of uh, care. And uh, I wrote it out of a place of grief, um, but also a place of thinking about how much I admire her. She's always been able to handle stress so gracefully. 
and just let it roll off her back and she's very easy going and just full of love so uh, I wrote this this song about her and for her and now for you <laughs> Rainy Monday, ain't nobody's fun day Streaming down the window, rushing to the storm Drain, it's a fine thing being stuck inside and Watching all the feelings water brings to light But there ain't no pain Through the pouring rain And she swings her head she curls her ruby lips. Do 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 do. La 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 la. La 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 la. Do 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 do. La 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 la. Early morning, bustling, interrupting, pulling on the dreamer, shaking. for the time and running out the door and joining in the race but there ain't no pain and it's a brand new day and she swings her hips and she curls She's like a little bird She floats away high above the world And all the hustle bustle of the world falls behind Do, 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 la 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 City's bustling, everybody's rushing, cars and people fussing, trying to find their place. Stop and listen, you can't hear yourself think. A hundred plates are spinning, riding around your brain. But there ain't no pain, and it's the same old day. And she swings her head. That was a rainy Monday for you. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, the next song on my list is a brand new song that I've just recently written and uh, it's called Shackles. And this song was inspired greatly by the pandemic and this crazy time we're in. And uh, yeah, it's it's been heavy. I think we can all agree with that. Um, it's been a heavy time and I have personally felt feelings of being trapped in this this crazy time that I can't escape. Sometimes I just want it to go back to normal or, or feel normal at least. Even if we're in a new normal, I want it to feel normal. So. I wrote this song also incorporating a memory of being um, on a trip and visiting a zoo and seeing this magnificent tiger 
uh, just in this, this cage on a concrete ground, uh, lying on a box, a cardboard box, this tiger. And I was, I was this close to it and I was terrified and I was horrified all at once uh, at the treatment of this tiger. So I, I incorporated that sense of being trapped, being a wild animal trapped into the uh, lyrics of this song. So I'm just gonna grab my ukulele here. All right, this is Shackles. shackles for you. All right, guitar again. So this next song I'm going to sing for you is called Sailor, and it's a song that I wrote again during this pandemic time, um, a little while ago actually now, 
uh, and it was included in a compilation album called Artists in Isolation that was put out by uh, Chilliwax Records and Yellow House Studio, uh, which is now called Rosewood Studio, actually. Um, and it was a project, um, it was really beautiful, actually. It was, it was a, a donated project by the producer, Sonny Rosa, um, to, to just sort of band some artists together and create something. And he wanted to give a gift of like sort of producing an album for us in order for us to make a little bit of money off of it. But uh, also just to reach out to the artist community and, and sh spread out some of the, the musical love that we've all been creating in isolation. So uh, this is my song, Sailor. Uh, and I'll let it speak for itself.
sailor. So if you're a lyric person like I am, you will hear a lot of themes in there of sort of standing strong in the face of stress, stressors, or, uh, you know, big storms that come our way. So that was really the, the meaning behind that song when I was writing it, just uh, feeling kind of stubbornly strong in the middle of the storm. So uh, some days I feel like that, some days I don't. <laughs> So I'm going to leave you with one final song. And this is this is also a new song. I've got, um, well, the Quirks, my band, have a an album coming out. It's a joint album with uh, Saint Soldier and Rosa, who are a duo in um, Cultus. Uh, and a few of these songs that I'm singing today are going to be on it. Rainy Monday, Colors, this one coming up. Um, I think that's it. Uh, but yeah, it's going to be due out sometime in November, so uh, keep an eye out for it. It's called Squared. Um, anyway, I'm going to finish with my song Colors, and this is this is a song that I wrote uh, really just to remind us how important human connection is and relationship, and in the middle of such crazy times uh, that we need to reach out to each other and maybe not you know, spend time close together sharing our germs, but but we can still be together in different ways. We can talk on the phone, we can text, we can go for walks outside carefully, um, but we need each other. And uh, that's really the, the gist of this song. Show me all your colors, red and blue and green. I will write a song I'll write a song Maybe under all the lights I'll sing it for you Will you sing along? You'll sing along La da 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 La da 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 La da 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 La La da da Show me all your colors, red and blue and green, and I will write a song, I'll write a song. Maybe under all the lights I'll sing it for you, will you sing? been a pleasure sharing some music with you. Thank you so much again to Langley Arts Council for including me in this wonderful online concert series. Um, peace to you all in this crazy weird time. Um, I'm going to keep writing music and sharing it with you in any way I can. So uh, feel free to check out my website. I've got thequirks.com. That's K-W-E-R-K-S. Um, or Laura's Lyric dot com. All right. Thanks so much. Goodbye.
Thank you, Laura. That was, that was wonderful. You have such a beautiful, soothing, calming voice that just makes you want to listen all evening. I hope you have a solo coming out soon. We'll keep, your, we'll keep our eyes open. Well, thank you, Laura and Kate, for such an incredible evening of beautiful, soothing tunes and lush lyrics. Thank you. Now, next week, we're going to have concert three. And we're going to be featuring Amanda Sum and Mackenzie, Mackenzie Widows, October 30th, 7 p.m. So don't miss out. Thanks for tuning into our online concert series. From our family here at the LAC to yours, we hope you stay happy and healthy so that we can return again once more. So sign up for our newsletter at thelangleyarts.ca and check out your YouTube channel called Langley Arts Council. It's quite easy to see. I, I have it on my TV and when I turn it on, it just comes up. So you can kind of like bookmark it. So have a good evening.